What's going on everyone? Another Tips and Tricks Tuesday. This is something that a lot of people probably carry in their backpack, but they're probably using something a little bit different to what I am. You've very likely seen it before, but I'm gonna show you guys what it is. So most people probably nowadays are running a pack with some form of meat shelf. I've got my XO here, and I just wanna show you how quickly and easily I can get this item out that I'm talking about. So in there's my meat shelf, and in here, I've got a very, very lightweight, but extremely handy tool. This is like a $10 saw from Bunnings Warehouse, and I would probably estimate that it's skull capped, maybe up to 50 deer now. Absolutely awesome, just a little wood saw. I probably shouldn't take this off because it's probably a little bit manky under there. Yeah, a little bit manky. <laughs> But this here, absolutely awesome. And being in the meat shelf, it just lives in there. And I don't even know it's there until I need it. Put this back together. And happy days. Do you have any tips and tricks for the guys at home, Ram? Me? <laughs> so another super handy thing about carrying a saw, if you pick up a traveler when you're driving, everyone knows what a traveler is. It's what, like when a stick or a branch gets stuck underneath your car. Sometimes they're really hard to get out. A little saw like that, if you've got it in your backpack, you can just rip it out, saw off the branch, move it away, get rid of that traveler. Another awesome thing is cutting up bones, like sh things like shanks and stuff like that. Sometimes if you if you miss the join with your knife, if you get sick of cutting away there with your knife, just grab the saw, it'll cut straight through it. Very, very handy tool. So hopefully that's helped someone out. There are some foldable knives like the Cyclones and that at Bunnings, which a lot of people use and really like. But as far as the ones I've tried out, that $10 Barco or Baco or however you say the name, absolutely awesome. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you guys have any tips or tricks, drop them down below in the comments. I'll see you guys next time.